Athena, Warthog Princess, and welcome to another Cyclic Vomiting Syndrome auction update. This is to share the items that have been sent to me recently to be contributed to the auction, which will start on March 5th. I still am working out the details of exactly the administration of it. Hi, baby, come on. Um, and we'll let you know about that. But I will put the information down below. It's not too late if you want to send some stuff. This cluster of items came from one person, all from one person, and this is from Dottie. Thank you so very, very much for your contributions. <laughs> Kelly, Kelly's excited too. Yeah, she just wants to go run. Okay, okay. Get up. Get up. Good girl. Get up. Yeah, you can't stay. You want to get on the chair? Okay, get on the chair. She won't sit there, but okay. Anyway, so this is a whole bunch of little items. Amazing though. So let me just grab just these first couple. So I'm not even gonna take them out of the plastic, but this is a Zip ID in Raspberry Fizz. These are all Vera Bradley items, of course. And some of these are um, much older items, which is awesome because they're all brand new attacks. Uh oh, Kelly. So excited. Um, but yeah, so Raspberry Fizz, really pretty. You can see the interior pattern there. This next one is Viva La Vera. It has a lot of bright, very springy colors, and the ribbon pools and zipper on this one are purple. So, very nice. The next item is a Gen Zip ID, and this is in Cuban stamps. And the Gen Zips, if you're not familiar, has like the Zip ID half, and then there's a second half right here, which is a snap pouch, and you can hold quite a little bit in there as well. And then the next item right here, this is the Euro Wallet in English Meadow. And I will maybe take them out of the plastic when we're doing the um, actual auction setup, take pictures, but then I'll put them right back in. So we're just not gonna mess with them today. Um, the next item is a nice little wallet actually. And this one is unwrapped, but it's still new with tags. It has two big slips here, like your cash door and receipts or whatever, you have a clear ID window, and you have three more card slots, plus you have vertical on this side behind them. On the outside, you have a snap closure with the tab, snap tab, and then you have a zipper for coins. This is the snappy wallet, and the pattern is boysenberry. And I do love my purple, so some of these items I might have to bid on myself. Yeah. We shall see. Um, this next item is one of the items I'm very interested in. This is an older item, um, which did kind of come back out recently in a limited thing, um, but in a snap card case, and this is Canterbury Cobalt. Um, this pattern also came out in a Canterbury Magenta, so same pattern, same everything, except instead of blue, it had like a, uh, an orchid pink color. But this is about the size of a Zip ID, roughly. I mean, it's a little bit smaller. So you can see right there, but it fits cards. Oops. <coughs> Excuse me, sorry. But it has a ring, it has a clear ID pocket on the back, it has a snap tab on the front, which protects three additional card slots on the front, and then right down the middle, there's another slot there too. All right, then we have a tech case. This is in night and day and it's got a removable wristlet strap on it it is nice trim pattern on the front and inside it is a nice little pouch and it has one slip on the side yeah i think i have this exact piece actually and then this piece i have not seen before actually um, this is an old black microfiber. It's called a pocket ID in black. It's kind of like a zip ID. It has a really nice quilting on it, which you're not going to probably see super well. I know you can kind of see it there, but it's black on black. But it's interesting. This is a little more rigid than the zip IDs. But it has this nice metallic VB on it, which is like embedded in the fabric there. So you can kind of see it sticks out a little really nifty and then it is like a zip ID on the other side with a pretty pattern and then it has the metal zipper and inside it is gusseted on the end so I actually can hold quite a little bit yeah and then this one has a quick release 
loop on it. So I don't know if that's the original loop that came with it. The loop here does not say Vera Bradley. So we'll see. Um, but there we go. And then there are two items in this next pattern. This is Deco Daisy. So we have a zip ID which has the hound's tooth inside. It's a pretty red and white floral. And then it also comes with this other piece, which is in the same pattern. And this is the all-in-one wristlet. <laughs> Interesting, because Vera has an all-in-one wristlet, or I guess they call it an all-in-one crossbody. Anyways, it's a little too close of a name to something that's current. But this one, I guess the smaller phones maybe could have fit in this little slip, but you could certainly put, um, cards or maybe your keys or chapstick or something in the little slip there and it has a wristlet strap that is sewn on one end and a hook on the other so you can hook it around things I suppose and then it's just a little wallet which is super cute it has a zip ID on the back side essentially and then you have a coin pouch and you have three card slots going this way and you have big slot behind it as well so it's a cute little wallet and I think I have a purse in this pattern, so I might have to... I'm not helping myself by bidding on all these awesome donation items. But anyways, uh, this is another of the same item. And this one is in, I think it's Portobello... No, this is watercolor. Not Portobello Road, sorry. Watercolor. And very, very nice little piece in the same little slip on the front. Let's look at what the interior is. Wow, that's a nice pink, pinky purple. All right, and then, because we're not done yet, it's very generous. These next several items are matching zip ID and lanyards, and I am going to try and keep them together, but we can address that um, between now and the auction, we'll figure that out. If you have your druthers either way, please let me know down below in the comments, just say, you want them, you would want them together or you would want them separate because I know, you know, these are older patterns. Maybe people want both. Um, I personally, if I was buying them, I would want both pieces, but you know, it all depends, I guess. So this first one is in Safari Sunset. Some of these patterns I have never seen in person actually. Um, but there's the zip ID and the lanyard is still wrapped and unopened. And then we have another one, and this one is in Lemon Parfait. So my green and yellow fans, this is right up your alley. The pretty florals inside as well. So it's a paisley and floral. And again, the lanyard is unopened. This next one is Lighten Up. This is the only Lighten Up item in this cluster. And this is in Daisy, or Ditsy Dot rather, Ditsy Dot. And so it's like the pink and mint kind of colors. So it's kind of one side is mint with pink and one side's pink with mint. And then the lanyard as well. And this next one is in Hello Dahlia. So it has the Dahlia flowers and then the coordinating interior and the matching lanyard unopened. All of these new with tags. And oh, this next one is Doodle Daisy. I have a little notebook that matches this one too, but really pretty blues and greens. Yep. It's happy, happy colors and new with tags. It's not in plastic, but a very obviously unused lanyard. Okay, and the last one, and this is one of the ones I might have to bid on, is Totally Turk, which is turquoise and kind of browns and tans. But turquoise is my birthstone, so I'm very partial to turquoise in general. And I definitely have some. I have the perfect shirt for this, and <laughs> maybe I'll take a picture with it in the auction. But anyways, there you go. So thank you again, Dottie. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And thank you to all who have donated so far, and those who have even thought about it, because every dollar counts. It doesn't have to be new with tags. It doesn't have to be... Vera even, it can be anything that you think we might be able to auction off and sell. Most of it is Vera, but anyway, thank you again, and I'll see you again soon. Bye for now.